it's Tracy and Kevin, and we are on spring break, so we're heading south for some warm weather. Well, maybe. We are headed to Pennsylvania. Where are we riding today, Kevin? Moon Lake. Where is Moon Lake? It's in Pennsylvania. <laughs> <laughs> it's in Wilkes Bar, Pennsylvania. No, it's not. It's outside thought... of Wilkes Bar. Okay, close enough. It's close to Wilkes Bar. All right, and there we go. All right, we'll see you there. Got it. I wanted to try, there was a rock you went up over, but I slid out in the leaves. Moon Lake Recreational Area is nestled within the Pinchot State Forest, which spans 942 acres and offers a haven for outdoor enthusiasts. Its landscape invites visitors to explore a variety of activities, including mountain biking, hiking, fishing, bird watching, and nature study. At the heart of this recreation area lies Moon Lake, a serene 48-acre spring-fed lake. <clears throat> With roughly 20 miles of single-track trails meandering through picturesque landscapes, there is a trail suited for every level of expertise. Woo! Yep. This trail is the NFS trail and is considered a black diamond and is primarily a downhill trail. It is about a mile long with 392 feet of descending and 65 feet of climbing. was established in 1968 with the primary goal of providing residents with recreational space. It was funded through the Project 70 Land Acquisition and Borrowing Act. This allowed the park to build an Olympic-sized swimming pool, including decks for sun tanning, bathhouse, and concession stands. During a particular heat wave in 1993, 10,000 swimmers visited this swimming pool in a single month. The park also contained tennis courts and baseball fields, as well as a large campground. It's like going down a river. By the late 2000s, Funding cuts led to the closure of several of the amenities, including the swimming pool and the campground. Deterioration and lack of maintenance in 2014, ownership transferred to the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, and the park was renamed Moon Lake State Forest Recreation Area. The park now offers passive activities like mountain biking, hiking, and fishing. That's pretty. The flume trail travels along Pikes Creek as well as a man-made concrete flume. This trail is about a half mile long and is bi-directional and is considered a blue. Hey. Baby. Want to go for a water? Want to go for a s slip slide? <laughs> Yeah. The 5A 5A trail is about a mile long and is considered a black diamond. Okay. Oh boy, that's cool. Okay. Ledgeview Trail is about two miles long. View. All right, fun fact. 
Did you know that the seventh installment in Nancy Drew point and click adventure games takes place at Moon Lake? It's the ghost dogs of Moon Lake. Okay, the plot. Sally McDonald is a friend of Nancy Drew's father who recently purchased a house on Moon Lake in Pennsylvania. The house is a former resident of a prohibition era gangster named Mickey Malone. Sally fled from the house in terror on the very night Nancy arrived for a visit. According to Sally, every night a pack of ghost dogs with glowing eyes and mournful hollows attacked her house. The dogs are believed to be the ghost of Malone's four loyal Rottweilers. They allegedly vanished into the woods on the day of Malone's arrest and were never seen alive again. Nancy seeks out the truth of Mickey Malone's colorful history amid rumors of buried gold. I've never played this interactive game before, but it sounds kind of fun. Glen's trail is about two miles long and is considered a blue. Overall, I found the trails at Moon Lake to be quite picturesque, with a good amount of flow and some fun technical elements. While we did encounter some confusion on the far southern trails due to insufficient markings, the majority of the trails were well signed. There's plenty to enjoy out there and I highly recommend giving them a ride. Additionally, I must commend the cleanliness of the bathrooms at the main lot. They were impeccable, setting a high standard for park facilities. Thanks for watching and make sure you hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss the rest of our spring break adventure.